Alright guys, welcome back to a very special Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. Today is a very special day because the World Tournament is officially over and the brand new Dokkan Festival for the new SSR Visa Final Form is here. They made a few changes to the actual banner itself. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what's on the banner. I'll do a summon myself. There's a bunch of events you guys can do. Get some easy Dragon Stones and a whole bunch of other events which they've al uh, already released into the game. You can do the new Ultimate Clash to get some more Dragon Stones. I know I completely used up my Dragon Stones because in this time when I was doing the World Tournament I didn't decide to go for just the actual main rewards. I wanted to go for the top 200 rewards to get all the orbs and everything I needed so I managed to finish in 195. So I used about 30 Dragon Stones just on World Tournament on its own so it's alright, it's alright. Um, Extreme Z Battle events are available and everything, some Guinea Force events are available, some Planet Namek Saga stuff is available, and a whole bunch of stuff including a brand new story event where you can actually go ahead and collect a Freezer and awaken him and an amazing pack which you guys should definitely grab which is definitely worth it. You can get one of the featured SSRs, you could get either one of these three guys. You could get either this one, this one or this one. You could get either one of these three guys. I'm going to do that summon uh on the actual main banner here so here's the actual uh, banner for the uh Dokkan festival uh also uh on the news they quickly gave out some uh quick rewards here let me show you guys really quick so seven dragon stones because we achieved first place on the new year Dokkan festival banner guys um i highly encourage you guys to go ahead and message bandai and akatsuki find out exactly exactly what happened with the new year Dokkan festival step up summon uh, on the fifth step, uh, you can only get LR UI Goku. You can only get him on the final step as the final SSR. Otherwise, you cannot collect him throughout the entire banner. I don't know exactly what they did wrong, but um, it's a big mistake. And a lot of global players have been messaging, even I've messaged them, and I got a reply from Bandai, but it was an automated reply. So we'll find out what's going on with that. But here's the actual banner itself. So you got the, a brand new freezer who's here he's got his active skill he's amazing this guy is a 10 out of 10 character right uh, what they did is they uh, replaced um beerus with kefla on this banner so he's a 10 out of 10 character he's got active skill and he transforms straight into golden freezer whenever you want he does extremely really good damage massive raising attack for one turn which is 100 percent increase only the super saiyan fours have that and um yeah, he's just absolutely ridiculous. He's really, really good. He's a re resurrected warrior or other warrior, other world warriors category leader. Four key and 150% stats. Four key and 150 to stats. That is really good. That's really good. Uh, he's got his super attack, which is the death psychonesis. Let's check that out. Click play on that. So this is his 12 key super attack. Actually, whoa, that's a bit, yeah, that's cool. Oh, I like that. Yeah, that's nice, that's nice. And then, um, so raise defense, immense damage, and seal super, that is ridiculous. Um, his passive skill is ridiculous as well. As soon as he gets hit, he's just gonna be doing way more damage, and he's gonna be dodging as well. So really, really good. And then um, he also lowers the attack and defense of the enemy that hit him for uh, two turns. So this guy is just ridiculous. So after he gets hit for five turns, he's just doing ridiculous extra damage and then his transformation you can do that immediately whenever you like and here's his super attack here the golden death blaster very nice very nice uh, guys if you want to summon i do encourage summon for this banner this banner is actually really really good uh so they changed from instead of beerus they put kepler here kepler is really really good i have no objections if you want to summon on this banner if you want to summon go for it because they got kepler they got Super Saiyan uh, God, Super Saiyan Ka uh, Goku Kaioken, and they got the transforming Goku here. They got Kula, Kula's here. He's absolutely ridiculous. You guys already know. And we got the transforming uh, Freezer, and we got Golden Freezer, and we got the SSRs. As you guys can see, they still left their Beerus SR here um, because yeah, they did remove Beerus, but yeah, it is what it is. Uh, but that's cool. That's cool. So. There's the actual banner itself. Now, let me show you guys the actual ticket banner so you can get the tickets here. Now, for the tickets, what you're gonna have to do is go into the Pilaf's Trove and it's a, such a cheap pack. $6.99, uh, $6 $6 yeah, and you get seven tickets. Uh, those seven tickets, you do the multi-summon. When you do the multi-summon, you get one guaranteed SSR 
in the multi summon, and that guaranteed SR could be either a blue Goku, Golden Freezer, or Kefla. So uh, you could pull him out of one of those three. I do encourage you get this uh, pack. This pack is actually super good, um, and it comes with Kefla slots, aged meats. Yeah, this pack is amazing. Uh, I will purchase this pack later on. We've got 13 days for that, so you've got plenty of time. So that's the Happy New Year pack. But yeah, that's the actual pack itself. So once you purchase that pack, you could get one of these characters. Uh, you you get either Freezer, Kefla, or Goku. You get either one of those guaranteed, and you could get these other guys unfeatured on the actual ticket summon. So new SSR Freezer ticket summon, and then you can get one guaranteed per multi summon. So you get one multi summon, but you get him guaranteed. You get one of them guaranteed. Okay, uh, I'm gonna do one multi summon for you guys on the actual Dokkan Festival banner. If I was to recommend anything, I'd say finish the steps here even though LRUI Goku is not on this banner definitely finish the steps and then go ahead and jump in on this banner if you want uh, I do want to jump in on this banner because this banner is amazing uh, hopefully we'll pull something good here fingers crossed We've got 17 on his own could that be something good we don't know sub saying 1 sub saying 2 sub saying 2 okay so let's see what we get uh, and then I'll do the ticket summon later on in the week. I'll get the tournament uh, prize uh, rewards. Uh, everyone will get them tomorrow. Or, uh, yeah, tomorrow. It should be tomorrow. Let's see if we get anything here. Yeah, three, four characters. Five. Yeah, not getting anything so far. Oh, we got a uh, TN. Not bad. And we got Raditz. Ugh. Terrible summon, terrible summon. No worries, I'll take my coins. Uh, it is what it is, but I'll jump in and I'll do more summons later on. Uh, so yeah, you can go ahead and do the Dokkan event and also the Awakenings have arrived for the Freezer Final Form and the Perfect Cell. You guys can do the event and also we've got Freezer's own event, uh, which has arrived training for Vengeance. A uh, bunch of free Dragon Stones here. You get six Dragon Stones from doing the stages, go ahead and do them. You get another two more additional Dragon Stones for completing all the stages. So that's eight dragon stones, and then you get one more additional dragon stone for getting this guy to super attack level 10. And then all you really need on the team is characters that are from the uh, terrifying conquerors. So this, yeah, terrifying conquerors give you extra boost. So you can make a full team of LRs and you're perfectly good. So there's that event and there's the freezer event and everything. Good luck to you guys on your summons. I do strongly suggest finish up the new year Dokkan festival step up summon. Once you do that, go ahead and jump in on this banner if you want. Kefla is really good. Kula is really good. Super Saiyan Blue, uh, Kaioken Goku is really good. Uh, every, everything on this banner is really good. Everything here, every character on this banner is very good. So, um, yeah, it's definitely a good summon banner. Definitely a good summon banner. So, yeah, uh, and then uh, also we've got the Ultimate Clash which has come. So, yeah, we can start doing that Ultimate Clash. I'll do a live stream on the ultimate clash for you guys so make sure you guys stay tuned to the channel and leave a like subscribe for some more Dokkan battle content I'm gonna keep you guys up to date because we will be doing summons towards the end of the week unfortunately new year <laughs> kind of dried out my pockets for Dokkan and legends you know I, I was summoning on both games so pockets empty but don't worry uh, we, we will get a refresher and I will go ahead and do the summons and there's more dragon stones you can collect here so you can get what seven and then you get 15 as well on top of that for doing missions yeah for the stages that you complete so there's loads of dragon stones here as well and oh yeah uh you can go ahead and go to the exchange shop this is the final thing if you go to treasures go over scroll all the way over and there we go the brand new uh, Lord Bobby and Deborah is there so I can go ahead and pick them up so Bobby and Deborah available on the exchange shop finally finally two months late but they're here so anyways guys if you did enjoy today's Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video make sure you go ahead and smash that like button subscribe for some more Dokkan Battle content and I'll see you guys on the next video peace out